Greetings from Southern Asia Division. The Global Youth Day is not only a phenomenon, but it is a festival for all the youth in Southern Asia Division. And not only for that day they celebrate, but for weeks together, and they have this festival. And we want all of you to sit back and watch the sermon in action. Namaste. Vanakkam. Sashriyakal. Namaskar. Pranam. Namaskaram. Derek and myself are super excited and delighted to invite you all to celebrate Global Youth Day 2023. Southern Asia Division believes love, love is, is a, a verb. verb. Welcome to Southern Asia Division. <laughs> Welcome back. When it comes to Formula One, we all know that name, Michael Schumacher. But when it comes to India, we all know another name, that is Narayan Karsikane. Do you know where he hails from? I know GK. Wait. Coimbatore, done it. Correct. Vanga pogalam. just all that I have to say to Coimbatore youth. Derek, you know what just happened? When I was conversing with Pastor Samuel Manimaran, he told me that the inmates of this old age home, most of them, almost 99% of inmates there have their children. They were just abandoned and they were asked to stay here. And here, Coimbatore youth decided to go through our theme to them and see how sad that they just decided to let their parents away. Exactly. Someone needs to tell the next generation how to treat their parents. That's why we have a wonderful theme this year. Love is a verb. Even in the Bible, the Ten Commandments says, Honor your father and your mother. Coimbatore youth. Honored the fathers and the mothers. Proving love is a very powerful verb. Marali swagata bani hogana namma Bengaluru ge. Lowry Adventist College. 
100 plus years of history and heritage. Let's see what the youth have there for us. that our love will be in action to reflect and to spread the word of God. Doesn't it bring tears to your eyes to see how an army of young people kept the theme running? Love is a verb. Hats off to you, Lowry Adventist College, for doing such a wonderful work amongst physically challenged children, especially the older folks. Surprisingly, even with the transgender community, Sharon, what is your take on this? A gentle reminder to everyone whoever is watching this. Love has no boundaries. Love the transgenders too. Thank you, Lowry. God bless you for what you did to them on this Global Youth Day. Love is a verb and it doesn't have boundaries. From Namma Bengaluru, let's fly to the capital city of New Delhi. Pastor Laban Rao is waiting for us. There are like groups of people out there. And here, one young man decides to walk out of the crowd, walk extra miles, decides to show love is a verb by rehabilitating a less fortunate man. And what do you think about that, Derek? This was out of the box. Exactly the word. Not all the time you need an army of young people. Pastor Laban Rao showed that even one man can be a one-man army in showing that love can be a verb. Hats off to you, Delhi, for that wonderful report. From Delhi, we are straight going to the city of diamonds, Surat, the kingdom of Metas. We appreciate the good work by the Metas group of institutions. They have just taught us that there's not one way, but many ways in which we can say that love is a verb. From sharing food, not just for one day, but two days. From car washing to medical camps. We salute your work that you have done and have set a standard for India to follow. Now, we take the diamond from Surat, put it on a ship,
and let's go to God's own country, Kerala. The youth of Kerala just love to color out of the lines and make the picture colorful every single time. And here we see a couple who decided to do that this time. You know, Derek, what exactly happened? Dr. Ben and Miss Blessing Sarah decided that their bedroom would be different from all the others out there. They decided they would pick up a less fortunate man from the street, dress his wounds, provide him his needs, give him everything that is essential. And here comes the most favorite part. They not just decided to feed people in their engagement, but decided that they would feed the birds out there. Kerala and Summer are like twin brothers. It's very hot in Kerala. There's a lot of humidity and birds suffer without water and food. And here, this young couple decide to go out of their way and feed the birds and take care of them. Here we see that they just not decided to copy the world, but they decided to be a different set of youth. This is a message to every single person out there who's deciding to get married. Let your marriage be a difference. They taught love is a verb, even to other living creatures this global you take. God bless you both. Thank you, Pastor Rajit, for this amazing report that just came to us. Yes, we are going to meet the man of the moment, the man from Southern Asia Division. Stay tuned. Welcome to Hope Channel India. It's Global Youth Day. Love is a verb. Amidst us, we have a dignified personal, Dr. R. N. Prabhudas, the Youth Director of Southern Asia Division. All throughout his life, he has worked and labored with young people and we are so delighted to have him amongst us today. Namaste, sir. Namaste, Sharon. Derek and myself are super delighted to have you on board here with us today. So tell me, so what's happening in Southern Asia Division? How are the youth working out there? You want to know? Uh, you want to know what uh, youth is doing in a Southern Asia Division? Yes, sir. I'm super delighted about that. Yes, throughout the entire Southern Asia Division, our youth getting ready for the Great Day, Youth uh, Global Youth Day. It's nice to see every single out youth out there just working to make this theme into practice. So, sir, I'm going to put you in a very tough spot now. So, tell me which is your favorite report of the year 2023? Well, you want to know the favorite report of uh, mine? Yes. Sharon, we have seven unions, six colleges, two universities. To me, all are very important and we receive reports from all the units which are very, very fantastic and very good. To all the unions out there, you have a great director. Now, let's go to the main feature of GYD 2023 Southern Asia Division. Let's see a report that is life changing that defines the theme, that just transforms everyone. Yes, this report is a definition of love itself. In three, two, one, let's go to Kolega.
No proper clothes to wear. No proper place to stay. No proper food to eat. And yet, love made the difference. What a powerful report. What a powerful statement to the entire globe that love can make a difference in a person's life, even if he's mentally challenged. Sharon, what do you think of this wonderful report? Derek, I had just have no words. You know what? I heard a lot from Pastor Dennis, uh, Brother Jacob Bagin, and his whole crew about this single person. To just imagine myself a day there is hard. To just see myself after a day's long work is hard. And here is a man who is living that way, who is stinging, who is shabby, and he doesn't even know about that. They walked extra miles. Love made way where there was no way. They dressed him. He had ringworms in his beard. Can you just imagine? He had ringworms in his beard. His hair was hard. It took 15 to 16 buckets of water to just to wash the dirt away. He wasn't ready for this. He wasn't allowing them to touch him. Their love came into action. Their love took over, did wonders. He gave us place to nurse him, take care of him. His hair was cut. He was dressed well with a nice shirt and jean. He looked like a whole different person. And there he started smiling back. Tell me anything more costlier than that smile. Tell me anything more precious than that. He decided to eat with every single youth out there. He was a man who was reluctant to even come and take this change. But here was this man who was happy, stomach full, bag full of clothes, and was covered with love. Love is the most precious thing you can offer to anyone. Yes, Sharon. We're out of words, right? Dr. Arun Prabhudas, what do you have to say about this wonderful report? Derek, it is indeed a unique, amazing report. I would like to thank the youth from Kolegal. They walked, ran, sat different miles of love. Let's go to the land of pickles. Let's go to New Swed. Global Youth Day has become the training ground for young people to become medical missionaries. Thank you, Newswit, for that wonderful report. Here, from Newswit, we go to another place that has our Hope Channel Studios there. Let's go to Harpur. Love is indeed making a difference in the lives of those people in the slum. Thank you, Hapu Church, for distributing the refreshments to these people who may not know that they have a tomorrow. Love indeed has given them a hope. And love indeed is a verb. The people in my set are just not able to contain themselves. We have report just pouring into us. It's all over Southern Asia Division. We are just 
overwhelmed by the work of the youth here. Now, let's look into some lovely reports. We, the youth of Prakasabram Church and James School, we have come here to the Good Samaritan Charitable Trust. This home has called the mentally challenged people. We are very much happy to spend our Global Youth Day with them today. Hello everybody. This year, the Central Canada Church is celebrating Global Youth Day continuously for three weeks, not just one week. And we want to celebrate this throughout this year 2023 because we are celebrating under the theme Love is a Verb. Adventist Youth Federation, some high note, it's one at Honi in Tisen and Bay, some high district blood bank at Tisenda, Paul Tehi, some high district hospital, Baka, private hospital, then, and Rin Berani Avangin, Tisenda, Paul here at the Molea, Tunchuma, Pohian Blan Bay, Tunchuma, Pohian blood bank at Tisenda, Paul, O Mumal Lower Vangin, from Nile, Lope Photo Train, Adventist Youth Federation, Tishil Shadley, and Nia, Karmasa Khan, some high south Adventist Youth Federation, Lam Swan. At Honin Tisen and Lopetoa, we can some pilot Adventist Youth Federation Tetsuan, District Hospital Blood Bank at Turin, Tisen He and Pevelea, Mi Som Liten Pein, Mi Pasom Tumparukle, Mitsia Paliten Tisen He and Petheni. Sampai District Blood Bank at Hoktutele, AVBD Tetsuan and Mamo Kuna, Gans Hengailo Adventist Youth Federation Tetsunga Lom Tua and Soyeni. We'd like to thank each one of you for sending in your reports on time and we thank you all for responding to all our emails. It's been such a blessing to see your reports and I hope that the world will acknowledge that love indeed is a verb. It's been a wonderful experience. Thank you so much. Love you all. Just love you, love you, love you all. Thank you for Teaching the world what I always believed in. Love is the most powerful action word.
I want to thank every one of you for your uh, amazing reports. I also would like to thank our GC Youth Director, Elra Bushi Kumalo and his team.